got a job for you if you've got a moment. <laughs> I need you to help me make some inspirational posters. I'm what? sorry. If you need to find me, I'll be back at my camp. Okay. We're going to stick to mostly the main mission in this one. Unless we fall behind in levels, in which case we'll pop and do a couple of the other ones. What else okay, what, what build do I want to go, guys? Um... Boom trap is looking pretty good. How are we feeling about that? Probably boom trap. Another character? Well, yeah, we're it's fine. Get the pirate ship cannon one. I don't know what that is, but that sounds amazing. Middle is good with friends. Middle tree for a team boost. Okay. Okay. Uh, hmm. Left is a good one too. Oh, okay. Apparently, a lot of people are are all over the map on this one. Uh, I think I'm gonna try Let's boom trap. See. Let's try boom trap. Which uh, one? Oh. Sure. Get some healing. Let's try some boom trap. Boom trap. Oh. Oh, that's cool. So I can face in space. Wait, where's my... Oh, there's my bar in the bottom. I can only do it once per jump, though. Okay. It's like a... It's like a feather fall, almost, with a little bit of a boost. Cool. Oh, that's kind of fun. So we can crouch in the air and slam down. Oh, God. Nice. Thanks, chat. Uh, I think we're above here, right? Up here, maybe? Yeah. It looks like we got to go around even further. Um, can I make this? Oh, we can go up this side. Cool. Cool. Here? I've set up a bunch of cameras at the apex of your jump. I just need you to get airborne and say oh. something inspirational. Uh. Sorry. Say something inspirational, y'all. Oh, this is the, the... Okay, we're still doing this. Believe in your dreams! Alright, cool. This time, I'll throw up a couple of targets. Try to shoot them before you land and they'll make for an even better poster. And say something inspirational again. Oh god, that? Oh Jesus. Here, hold on. Follow your heart. Good, good. Now, big finale time. Get into the air, then slam down on that pressure pad by crouching. Then say something cool and look as badass as possible. I mean, let's act like I didn't just totally miss the pad. Thanks, Dad. Really out. It. Oh, Yiggs! All right, that was cool. Now turn on the printer and it should spit out your posters. <laughs> okay, let's go turn the... Oh, look at all the cameras. That's kind of great. I heard Ko was looking for new mods. Yep, this August, in August 1st, we're gonna be opening up new mods. It's not a joke, because we actually are. Um, <laughs> but yeah, good timing on that. Hey Wilhelm, you wanna come to the moon and hunt a- Hey Wilhelm, you wanna come to the moon and hunt- Hey Wilhelm, you wanna come to the moon and hunt a vault for me? No. I'll pay you a couple million dollars. Okay. 
Yep, that's my backstory. <laughs> nice. Where'd I leave that thing? There was no film in the cameras. Just kidding. Joke. Don't freak out. A fantastic day for capitalism. Deadlift, that guy I asked you to kill, just ordered a bunch of inspirational posters. I have motivational issues. Head to his ship and put them up everywhere. Here, take the posters and the delivery confirmation. Okay, we're gonna go back to main quest. What level is the main quest? Three, we are. Oh, perfect. All right, let's go. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Where can I access and apply for the position of a mod? And does the mod have a national insurance contribution for these in the UK? No. No, it does not, first of all. Um, the mod is a tipped position uh, to start with. So it's essentially the exact same as if you would receive tips as a streamer yourself. Um, it is not like a, a full contract position or anything like that. Those positions are available on my team, but they're for the senior part of the team. Yeah. Um, which you could be someday, but entry level is just basically volunteer plus tip. Yeah. You're paying for decades of experience. You're paying for professionalism. You're paying for loyalty to the mission above all else. Yeah? That way, yeah. Told General Knox. Loyal to the mission is one thing. Loyal to people is something else. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, we're going to be opening up mod applications probably on August 1st. So if you're interested, uh, you can apply then. There's, uh, It's like a little Google form. Let's you put in, you know, all sorts of fun stuff. And uh, then once we get a bunch of mod applications, we usually leave it open for a week or two. Um, then the boatman, who is the mod manager, he kind of goes through all of them and pulls out the ones that look really good. At that point, those go to the team. I don't even see them. And then the team talks about it picks out some of the people they want then that goes to me we look over it together and then uh we kind of all as a team decide who we're bringing in um also as a quick reminder that junior mods which is what a mod starts as on the team is a unpaid position for the first couple months as we like figure out if you like to be on the team and if you want to be on the team and if you're working well on the team and everything and then um generally two to three months uh the team makes you at that point a senior mod and at that point, you're getting a portion of mod days. Uh, you have a default tip amount per month, that kind of stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then as that works on, there's all sorts of specialty positions on the team, like mod manager, secretary. You know, we've got artists, programmers, YouTube guys, and, and those are more full-time positions. What's the story on this deadlift dude? Yeah. Why you want him dead? He's kind of a dick. That it? Well, he also stole my Moonzumi Digistract key, stranded me out here, and got really rude when I told him I wasn't into guys, but mainly the being a dick thing. Flying combat packages! Love it. 100% more! <laughs> Minion trap. I'm really good at misusing power, stealing money, and banning people for no reason. Do I count? Do I need other qualities? No, that's pretty much exactly what we're looking for. So make sure to be here August 1st and uh, throw in an application. I'm, I'm looking forward to getting it. That's that's pretty much everything. Yeah. You're what we call an overachiever. Vault Hunter, this is Colonel Zarpadon. <laughs> you must leave Elpis. Things are about to get much Kathy worse. Kathy says, is a law graduate a good entry level position? A to. good entry level for this position? That's no, that's bad. what we call extremely overqualified. Really enjoy no. killing you. Fine. Do what you will. Deadlift, this is Colonel Zarpadon. I need you to kill the Vault Hunters headed for your ship. Get that, sir. I ain't taking orders from the chick who threw me in prison. They said your jump pads are stupid. I will annihilate them! Nice. That's like the laziest I will annihilate them I think I've ever heard. The most apathetic. I like it. Is being a sub required? No, not at all. No. Nope. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about this a lot more um, as we get closer to... Uh, to August 1st, for sure. Does a mod help with offline chat? Um, offline chat is 
not moderated. Obviously, I would not want mods to be here 24 seven. Um, but what we do, what we do do is like if people are flagrantly abusing channel rules in offline chat and stuff like that, and a mod will come in and see it, then I mean, thing, the channel rules apply offline, but it's not moderated. If that makes sense, Does that makes sense. Yeah, channel rules still apply, but but it's not directly moderated. Also, offline chat a lot of times is like really active, so it's not not the easiest thing. Yeah. Anyone else looking forward to play Fire, uh, co-playing Fire Emblem? Dude, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Fire Emblem. The more I hear about it, the more I'm excited about it. Uh, where can you monitor the application process? Uh, you put the applications on August 1st, and if you're selected, we contact you. That's the application process. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> if you're not picked, there we, we do not contact those that are not selected to let them know that. Yeah, it goes into a bottomless black hole where you're constantly wondering if you're good enough and you never really know for sure. Great. Awesome. Uh, do good I talk. spy mercenaries approaching my ship? I will soar into the air, but I'm wearing my shoe with a butt slam. Hi, <laughs> bro. <laughs> I like this guy. is the application a form you have to fill out? Yes, uh, it's usually a Google Doc, a Google form. Mm -hmm. Although again, most I, I leave most of this to Boatman, who is uh, I think out of town right now. So uh, he'll he'll be the one that's gonna be making most of these decisions. Part of his position is bringing in new mods, so he runs that process. uses yeah. that jump pad as his front door. He might wanna do the same. The answer is a solid maybe. Well said. Yes. This ultimate is ridiculous. Oh, got some guns in there. Hey, Bronto. Uh, Kathy, is a CV sufficient to write a cover letter? Uh, Kathy, it is. Kathy, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be full disclosure here, bud. Um, the, the, I would not think it's nearly as serious as that. Um, I will say that that it's it's the kind of thing where um, I would not want it to deprive the world of any budding talents. A good way to think of the mod stuff is it's more for people that are already here, already parts of our community, um, recognizable names uh, in in the community. Like, it's, it's essentially just kind of something for people that are already here to help out with and do. That could eventually lead to something more, but not necessarily. So, like, from the sounds of it, um, you've got a real good head on your shoulders. Um, so, I, I, you know, like, especially if you're talking about, like, law school and stuff. Um, yeah, yeah, I would say probably stick to that. Yeah. So, are you saying that mod modding isn't a serious job? That's exactly what I'm saying. It starts as generally a compensated volunteer position. That's that's exactly what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Yeah. Not every mod is paid as a full-time position. In fact, I I don't have a lot of full-time positions. Most of the modding is just like volunteer slash tips. So it's an internship at Co Inc. It is for the first couple months. Um, if you do get senior mod though, then a portion of mod day goes to you every month, which we do every month. And then I also have a, a fixed amount that I add in every month as well from the uh, the tips that I receive too. So it's kind of like I just pass them along with the mods. Mm -hmm. Even a lawyer needs a side job. Hey, fair point, fair point. Why am I so bad at this game? Because I'm bad at most games I play. It's kind of a thing on the channel. Just wait until you get your ult and then you are amazing. I already have my ult. I'm still terrible, don't worry. Oh 
It's like Daft Punky. I like it. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and I think max so this out, probably. Many choices. Does that mean Dr. Eagles was promoted? Oh, no, no. Eagles was actually demoted for that issue a little bit ago. Yeah, he just doesn't know it yet. Don't tell him. It's a secret. <laughs> Used grenade? So wait, wait, wait. Can I, can I trigger the different ultimates by doing certain actions? This is such a weird ultimate. I can. Okay. I got you, Sarah. So what's that other option? Revive with oxygen? Oh! Oh, look at that! Interesting. It's like a quick revive. Okay. That's kind of cool. Can only I do that, or can everyone do that? Have I played Warframe recently? Yeah, yeah, I was playing Warframe a week and a half, two weeks ago, when we uh, watched TennoCon. Which was awesome this year, by the way. Oh, well, I went way too far, didn't I? But we got some loot! Ooh. Uh, sure, I'll go that way. Oh, that's a weird one. Okay. Uh, let's go back this way. Hey, Gegenstein, what's up, buddy? Okay, I think this dude is right over... Oh, it's a jump pad. Got it. Use jump pad, kill deadlift, pick up the destruct key. I disabled the jump pad! Forgive me, jump pad! I didn't mean it! Crap! Better head up to that geothermal substation, see what the damage is. Oh, you mean the one we just cleared to? Cool. Good. Good talk. Let's go. Crouch while in the air to butt slam? Yes. Yes, we know. Thank you. Mm -mm -mm. Don't let those hoity toity Hyperion goons take one more step. We good? I think we're good. Mm. Boop. Boop. How did that work? Oh, fuse is busted. Got an idea though. You could be the fuse. Elaborate. If you complete the circuit between those two live wires, it should reactivate the jump pad. Just stand between the two sparky bits. Uh, is that gonna hurt? Yep, gonna hurt lots. Ooh. Right, now just go kill the guy so you can get to Concordia. Why are okay. those Hyperion screwbags still alive? Oh, this thing starts firing a lot quicker once you hold it down. Okay, cool. Not a lot of ammo, though. Still, the explosive bullets, man. I need to get an actual, like, bullet gun. I hate the travel time on these bullets. We actually did something right for once. All right. How is Coast still alive? I know. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. What's the Warframe glyph code? Co Carnage, all one word, all caps. You got to ride Boop. jump pads? I never got to ride a jump pad. I also witnessed the deaths of many innocent people. But jump pads, though. Attention, breathable atmosphere. But, but jump pads. Jump pads. 
Why am I playing this character? Chat. Why do you think? Come on now. The boss fight has landed. Ooh. Okay. There he is. Uh, Just kill his dumb ass and I can get you closer to Concordia and finding that jamming signal. I can't wait to toss your corpse onto a <laughs> jump pad and watch it take to the air like a child's imagination. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Uh, Pixel Chick. Hey, Code. Thanks for making my ribs hurt from laughter the last five years. If you have time, I think Final Fantasy Tactics will be an awesome game to do at some point. Pixel Chick, thank you so much for that. I have some good news for you. If you like Final Fantasy Tactics, uh, tune in end of this month. I'm going to be playing a game called Fire Emblem, which I've heard is kind of similar. So, yeah, that might be it. Something, something to like. And thank you so much for your five months, my dude. Hey, Zayla. What a nice thing to say, man. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, let me go help Sarah. Oh, God. No, I'm not. Sorry, Sarah. Oh, God. Is there anything we can do to help him? Is that... It looks like that's... Oh, it's turning off? No, it's not. I'm going to try to help you, Sarah. Woo! Get out of there, bro. Wait, what is this? What is this? What am I doing? Why am I invisible? Oh, this is zeros? Okay. Okay, cool. Oh my god, I need a real gun. Oh, there we go. Big hits. There we go. Ow, ow, ow. Does this work? Please work. Please work. Yes! Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Ow. How dare you say my ass Oh, my Lord. There it is. Must be somewhere around here. Go. Oh, that was fun. Clapstrap skill always refills his HP and gives health regen. The specific effect past that is semi-random based on various criteria such as your HP shield, enemies present, allies present, allies down, and I think a couple others. Yeah, I saw like grenade used was one of them, yeah. Um, cool. Great. Thank you. I honestly think this is kind of like Claptrap seems kind of fun. I missed a blue gun. Did one of you guys get it? Hold on, someone's shooting me over here. Did somebody pick I if somebody picked up the blue gun, blue gun, that's fine. As long as somebody got it. Yeah, okay, so says he grabbed it. Great, we're good. We're good. Let's go. Ow. Boop. They have music though. Thanks for being patient, Mons. A shaf says blame Servani. Oh yeah, completely. Completely. It's always Servani's fault. Actually today it was Yiggle's fault too. So blame Yiggles as well. Am I glad to see that? Pick it up. Oh, rip oh. Now you've got the Digistruct key, oh. you can turn on one of my moon zoomies at the Dara Way Station. Get yourself there, moon but be careful. Zoomies? Scavs have taken over that place after the Krakening. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, that's a chest? Oh, dude, I just walked right by those. Oh, my lord. I'm totally blind. Okay. Yeah, I thought those were just, like, normal things in the wild. My lord. The blindness chat. The blindness is real. Mm -mm. I tell you, it's like I don't even know what I'm doing, dudes. What is this? Clap trap, start boot up sequence. Directive one, protect humanity. Directive two, obey Jack at all costs. Directive three, dance. No, 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 cancel directive.
Directive 3. Commencing Directive 3. I friggin' hate that guy. Ah, one of my very first startup sequences. The memories. Oh, that was pretty great. That was pretty great. Ooh, oh, four ammo per shot, though? But I think it's better. Let's do it. Chat, that's right. Commence Directive 3, chat! Immediately! Every one of you. No, the blue gun was the one I dropped. We're good. Thank you, the chat. Those oxygen geysers will refill your Oz kit. Just step mm. into one and take nice. a good job, guys. whiff. Proud of you. That's some, that's some good. That's some good breaking it down. Let's get this party started. Morning, Logan. Oh hell yeah! I've got a fistful of pain. I feel like Gunzerker was super OP. Oh my like, this guy, like, the the freaking awesome, my lord. The ultimate is completely badass. Help here. Sorry, I'm such a badass. Mm -hmm. oh, so much to learn. Okay. Let's get this point in. We'll keep doing the, uh, the sustainability stuff. Do 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 do. The Gunzerker forces your team to fire too. Oh wow! Salvador is the strongest character in Borderlands 2. Gunzerker OP. Oh cool! Right on, man. I have no idea how to build Wilhelm's as Cervani. If anyone has any tips for him in chat, I'm sure we'd all appreciate it. Oh wait, what is this? Oh, I guess we gotta go to the south, maybe. I love this place. I love you too, buddy. Check the bottom skill in the skill tree. Those are his ultimates. Oh, for this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But actually, I haven't even looked at those yet. Let me take a look. So for our ultimate, we're going to get increased fire rate, reload speed. The lower your health and shields, the greater the bonus. This an old also unlocks pirate back. ship mode. Happened, lava erupting everywhere had them buggering off pretty quick. They left whole factories here to rot. Equipment just lying around. After a few years, the first fleet arrived. It wasn't the first one here, but that's what they called it. People started living here again. Maybe living's an overstatement, but people are here amongst everything else. No one really knows why the Krakening happened, but most people you run into will say Dahl caused it, extracting minerals or something. I don't know. I guess stories don't have to be true to be believed. They just have to be told. And I tell that one a lot. <laughs> uh, there we go. Ah, let me help. I would have been fine. Thanks. Ooh. Oh, just O2. Man, the blue O2 is going to trick me, I'm sure, more than once this run. Hey, just heartless. How you doing today, bud? Bodomingo. Good morning. Bodomingo, that's not going to work, bud. That's not going to work. You can't come in here slamming my emotes around like it's going out of style when you're sitting there with a VIP icon next to your name and not able to do it. That's not going to work for me. It's not going to work for you. So you survived there you go. Pass. Big deal. I dare you to come over here and try that crap. Get over here so we can avenge Deadlift in a sick ass space suit. Okay. Sounds good to me, man. Ah, oh, crap. I didn't think you'd actually come. Whoa. That's what it's all about. Baboom. Oh, God. There's a lot of dudes over there. The deuce? There we go. Badass scab over here. Got Cervani? Rips through ammo with that before use. What is? Yeah. Let's check. Selfie TV, thanks for that, my dude. He is wildly inaccurate. Make our way to the waypoint. 
Absolutely, Botomingo. Thanks, man. Oh, Sub Sassin just got an uh, two gamers, one gamepad. Oh, Lord. Sorry, guys. Oh, now yeah. Just get a vehicle and come on back. If you want to kill some kragans while you're out there, I'm looking. Make sure to stop by. I got something that'll get you into Concordia. Maybe you can find your signal there and get back to your ruddy huge space station. Oh, that is cool. Dude, best vehicle weapon? Badass. Nice. Hey, guy on the couch. Good to see you, buddy. <laughs> and hello to you and your son. Okay. Oh. All right, Servani's, Servani's on, on point. Let's do this. Where are we going right now? Pick up Orbitron? Let's go. I think our other guys are going to grab another car now. Hey, you survived. That was me high-fiving myself. They're looking for me, so I gotta go radio silent. Find the jamming signal, shut it down, and return to Helios. Whoa, 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 whoa. security work on the inner worlds. Duty is a treasonous offense, punishable by death. Oh, we all died. Oh. Boop, boop. Give it up, soldier. Look like Go, you boys. <laughs> Stakes were made. Do I, do I jump it? Oh, I got a boost, don't I? Oh, too late, too late. Too late! <laughs> Whoops! I probably should have thought of that a bit earlier. Yes. Yes. Um, yes, here, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, give me like three minutes. Maybe less. We got this. Oh god, okay, we're good. We're fine. Things are good. Alright. Ow. Co taking the role of claptrap seriously. I like it. Jake Break Gaming, cheers to you, my dude. Mm. Let's go. Pick up Orbitron. 